Pat Love from Love Healing Hearts back with a verdict. Here we go. <laughs> I really appreciate you guys participating in this little survey of mine. Not that anybody cares about what somebody does with their hair. I know it's not the end of the world or the beginning of it, but I just like having an honest consensus because we don't always see ourselves the way others do. And I really, really tried to talk myself into letting my gray grow out. But um, I wasn't quite convinced. <laughs> so I thought, well, let me see what everyone else says. And you guys helped convince me that I was right in the first place by not wanting, you know, not thinking that I should. Anyway, here we go. Because that is my opinion. I've always felt like since I started aging from caregiving of my husband, you know, age showing on my face, that uh, I don't look as good with gray hair. And that is the vote. The color wins. Okay, here we go. Uh, I'm going to read you guys' comments if you want. Let's see here. The, the, what, the cutest one to me was the shortest. That was LOL. They probably were busted up laughing. <laughs> but anyway... Okay, the next one was, this was cute, and I'm only reading, you know, sections of them. The gray is okay, but color looks better on you. I am 50, been gray since 18. Early gray runs in my family. I color my hair also. My hair is type C4. So anyway, that was nice. Then the next one is, you are a very beautiful woman. Oh, I thank you. Oh, excuse me. Okay. Um, I say let the gray come in. With the length of your hair you have, it will be awesome. Hey. Okay. Next one. Thank you. Uh, oh, sister. It was a shock to see your gray hair. Your hair gray to me doesn't look anywhere as pretty. I think you should color it as long as you can. Okay. Uh, next one. Pat, you are beautiful. I love these beautiful things. Anyway, you are beautiful from the inside out. You should definitely continue to color it. <laughs> You're too vibrant and youthful to be white haired. However, if you're looking to portray wisdom... That's cute. Okay, next. Sister Pat, you're beautiful inside and out. As a hairstylist myself, I understand the time it takes for hair maintenance. You can say that again. But here's the bottom line. The color is very flattering. <laughs> and you wear it well. <laughs> well, I know that wipes out the gray too. Okay, let's see here. Uh, I really appreciate this, you guys. Okay. My 59-year-old cousin is marrying a 45-year-old man. She kept her hair dyed. Please keep it black or dark brown, Sister Pat. <laughs> when I watched your show with a friend, we thought you were in your late 40s or 50s. Gray hair can be beautiful, but black hair compliments your youthful, energetic personality walk. Oh, anyway, okay, um, ego tripping right now, so y'all just bear with me. Uh, all these people calling me beautiful. Okay, uh, you should do what's best for you. Going gray is a natural part of life. It should not be something to be embarrassed or ashamed of. Not implying that is you, but you should do something to, em what do you say? But should be something to embrace and welcome. Yeah. Anyway, I do welcome it. I just, I'm, my face is just not ready. <laughs> okay, you guys. Thank you so much. And now that you know, the, the color has it. That is the vote. So God bless you, and you'll be seeing me do something in my hair between this weekend and the beginning of the week. I'll be doing a few more videos tonight because I said I was going to read some dreams, so... Be ready. Some more coming. Toodles.